this long. Doesn't look easy to understand? No. No. I was trying to use this for my science class to explain and introduce Gregor Mendel, the father of genetics. Wow. So he kind of um, researched why you have certain traits, which are the visible expression of your genes. So let's say Bobby. Any of your traits that you notice? Green eyes, brown hair. Green eyes and brown hair. What about your brother who's related to you? What about his eyes? Um, brown eyes. Brown eyes. Same color hair, but different color eyes. Ooh, what about you? I have brown eyes and brown hair. Wow, two kids with brown eyes, brown hair, one with green. Hmm, how did that happen? Well, what Gregor Mendel did is he worked um, in his garden. He was an Austrian monk, and he decided to do research on pea plants. We love, love our peas. peas. We do love our peas. And if you notice, his first ever experiment was on pea plants that had a purple flower and pea plants that had a white flower. Again, these represent the chromosomes. And every plant has DNA and little genes, alleles, that encode for that purple so flower. So does this have two purple alleles and two white alleles? Yes, the parents were two white alleles for the one gene that's expressed as the trait of white flowers, and they had two alleles on the color of flower gene, which was for the dominant purple. So what he noticed is that when those parents, the P1 generation, had offspring, it produced... <gasps> Ooh, that's All a hard purple flowers. All purple flowers. He used it as the F1 first generation. Can you say that word? Let's try it. F1. Filial. 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 First filial. generation. Filial. It is the filial. And all of them had purple flowers. But what happened to the mom? Or the white flower? Why are they all How come purple? the white flower is not here? They are. They're just hidden because the purple is a dominant color. You're right. Purple must have been dominant because the white allele is there. All of these offspring have two alleles for the color flower gene. But guess what? The white is there, but it's just not showing. It's not being expressed. The purple hides it. The purple must be hiding it. Because then Gregor Mendel took two of the offspring and they self-pollinated. So it basically had a, instead of having the two purple alleles, this one had a, a purple and a white allele. And this purple, one had a purple and a white. and a white allele. And here, what happened to their offspring? Whoa! There's a white one. There's a white flower. So he had, it looked All like. All purple. It got one, it got, this, this plant got both purples. Okay. That plant got, got the purple and the so white. So the alleles for the gene of flower color was purple white, but the purple's only the one showing. And this one was purple white and purple showing, and then the white. This must have gotten both whites. Both whites, which allowed finally to the white to come through.